offering of the Holy Mass. Accept, Most Holy Trinity, the sacrifice fulfilled at one time by the Divine Word and now renewed on this altar through the hands of your priest. I unite myself to the intentions of Jesus Christ, priest and victim, that I may be entirely offered for your glory and for the salvation of all people. Through Jesus Christ, with Jesus Christ, and in Jesus Christ, I intend to adore your eternal majesty, to thank your immense goodness, to satisfy your offended justice, and to beseech your mercy for the Church, for my dear ones, and for myself. Dear brothers and sisters, good morning. As the liturgical season draws to a close, the readings deal with the last things, death and judgment. Jesus in the Gospel speaks of the end of the Temple of Jerusalem. This end points to yet another, the end of the present reality, which will be transformed with the Lord's second coming. The world, with its natural beauty and wonder, as also its contradictions and pains, is passing away. Full of hope, may we set our eyes on Christ and His kingdom. For here, we do not have a lasting city. To preside our Mass is Reverend Father William Billy Molly of the Society of Jesus. Bukas Loob sa Diyos, SPE Ministry, Davao City, is our participating choir. Please stand. Let us joyfully celebrate and together sing our praises. of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And also with you. We are so happy again to come together as members of God's family, members of his kingdom, members of his mystical body to join our prayer with that of Jesus to the Father for the needs that we have, but just as important for the praise we offer to God in thanksgiving for all the blessings he has given to us. And one of the great modern blessings is this TV mass. Imagine, we have no idea of how many homes with persons who have handicaps, they have disabilities, they cannot leave even their bed or their house. They're crippled or just plain weak and sick. And because of the modern invention, the mass media, we can go to them, and they, in their challenge of the life they are leading, can join with us 
in this celebration for the shut-ins. And so we here are grateful to you for joining us in praising the God, praising our God and asking him to give us what we need or what we yearn for. So let us begin as we do every liturgy on this 32nd and uh, celebration of the ordinary time to confess our sins to him and to one another. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have sinned to my own fault, in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do. And I ask the Blessed Mary of the Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to life everlasting. Amen. 